Today I'm going to show you how to download fonts for your design space on your iPad. The first thing you'll want to do is download a font installer. So go to your app store and search any font. Here where it says open, it will say add. If you haven't added it, go ahead and click that button. Next, go to Defont or whatever website you wanted to download your fonts from. Find the font you want and click download. You might be prompted to confirm the download as well. Once your font has downloaded, you'll want to open it in any font. So we will go back to the any font app and up in the top bar, you'll click the plus sign to add a font. Once you click the plus sign, go down to iCloud Drive, which should be your last option and you'll see the I Love Glitter font zip file there. Next, find I Love Glitter in your fonts, click it and click the green install button. You want to click allow and then you'll be prompted to go to the profile downloader in your settings to download the font. Go to settings and then go to profile downloaded in the top right or left corner. Click install and you'll be prompted to enter your password for your iPad. Go ahead and enter your password click next, click install, confirm your install. And when it's done, you can click done and go back to any font to make sure it has been installed. You'll see in the any font app that there is a check box next to the Isle of Glitter on the right hand side. To open your font design space, make sure design space is closed out and then open Cricut design space again. Click new project, click text, and then you'll want to filter to the system fonts or the fonts that are on your iPad. Search for your font name. So we'll search I love glitter, click the font and add your text. For more Cricut tips, tricks, and tutorials, be sure to subscribe to Tastefully Frugal. Have a great day.